Yeah, yeah, we are, we are in discussion with the contractor. There is uh, a few areas, sticking areas. We have reduced the scope to make it affordable in terms of our proposal, but we still have one challenge, uh, uh, traffic volume guarantee. Um, the fact that we cannot guarantee the government of Kenya, if we guarantee the traffic volume using the route, then it means that it becomes a debt on the part of the government that it reach a stage at some point where we have to pay 20, 30, 40 billion in a year to meet the obligation of the contractor or, or, or the financiers uh, in terms of repayments. That is the place that we are, we, we are unable to agree. And so we are having a final stage of conversation. We need to close that before 1st of July to determine whether we will go on or not and then see if we can re-advertise or not. Uh, but uh, constructing the road we must do, not just Rironi Mao Summit, it, could, it eventually should be Rironi Malaba and uh, on the other side Mombasa, Nairobi. Uh, we are having also discussion with some of the investors to make sure that we dwell Mombasa, Nairobi and toll it. Kenyans are willing to pay a toll fee if it is reasonable and the roads have no traffic, you know, because if I tell you pay 200 shillings to go to Nakuru but go faster without stopping, you will pay than to spend six hours in a, in a, in a, in a 150 kilometers uh, road. Really, you, in those six hours you spend, you have wasted, calculate the time wasted, but also calculate the fuel wasted in traffic. It's too much. But if you, if you, if you guarantee Kenyans that you'll pay 200, 300 shillings to go to Nakuru, but you will go non-stop, you know, people will pay.